Hey guys, Hold 2 here, and I'm playing Team Deathmatch on Resistance. I know you haven't seen a video from me in a while, but this video is definitely worth watching. It has something new that hasn't happened to me yet in Mono for 3 or even Call of Duty. And uh, I'm playing with my friend Bamfita, and let's just say the new thing involves me and Bamfita and another guy on the enemy team. So, I'll, I'll, I'll make another clip at the end of what really happened, but you're just gonna have to wait and see so this the gameplay was pretty decent I went like 39 and 10 or 39 and 9 with a pretty sick uh, little moment at the end as well as the moment before okay whatever so going on now commentators these days are always talking about a uh, different topics and whatnot and the topic today I wanted to talk about was the fact that I'm a high school student, and I care a ridiculous amount of what other people think. Like, not not just of what they think of... Just, just basically what they think of me. I, I care a lot about people. I'm a compassionate person, and I care a lot about what people think of me. It definitely affects me every day, and... Something recently happened that made me want to post, uh, or do the commentary of this video on that. Look at this guy camping. Couldn't help that. But, uh, yeah, so, this silly little project for school, and it was about... Throwing a line here. But it was about, okay, I can do it. It was about how, uh... We were making a project in this journalism class, uh, this media class, and it was about how we could design a food and make a like a media release about it, like make an advertisement, make a slogan, where it'd be uh, sold, how much it would be sold for, what it'd come in, packaging, everything, and do a whole like media release on it, like if we we're gonna release it to the public, legit. So, my group came up with like these s'mores cupcakes kind of thing. They've kind of been done before, but they're not like really popular or generic. And so my group was doing a lot of work. This one girl particularly doing a lot of work in my group. And I, I normally hate it in groups when uh, one person is doing all the work and I hate it when I'm always doing all the work in a group of like two or three where you know, you get stuck with two people that don't do anything, so I really wanted to do more and to do like some extra credit sort of, we uh, could make our thing, so I attempted to make s'mores cupcakes and I actually did a pretty good job, I think, and I was told I was doing a good job, but the day before I made them, or the day of I made them and it was going to be presented the next day, I made enough for the whole class, and I just thought how it was such a big deal to me like bring in this thing of what people would think bring in this huge amount of um, like bag and cupcakes like just cupcakes oh, I, I care too much about that and about if the people wouldn't like them and how it'd go and I care too much about what my peers think of me and my actions that it kind of prevented me from really doing other things like who knows what I might have thought if I didn't feel that way towards uh this little thing here and I remember some advice someone gave me in earlier grade school and it was like they didn't care too much and they were having a much better time in school than I was and they basically said just don't care as much and I thought that was so hard for me to do but it really is true you're having the same problem as I do like just don't care as much like you can't satisfy everyone like not everyone is gonna like a video and I'm just gonna subscribe to you and you can't satisfy everyone like this kid in an earlier grade school I, I was nice to everyone back then like like for even if I didn't know I'm was wait I, I still am that way but not like I don't care too much I don't care as much as I do now but Like, I didn't care too much about that back then, and 
so this kid in seventh grade, he basically out of nowhere uh, addressed me as a faggot. Like down my back, so he didn't say it to my face or anything. But he addressed me as a faggot, and one of my friends told me, one of my close friends. And I I, I thought about this so much, and like I didn't even know the kid. I I knew of him, but I didn't I didn't really. It, it, it was a big deal to me, it was such a big deal that I basically uh, thought about it for a lot and at, at to a point I didn't care enough because if the kid didn't even know me and probably just like heard a story or something and it's just me as a faggot I wouldn't, that, that person I should not care about because if they can just judge that quickly and not even know the person you, you should not care about them you should not care about what they think of you and that's basically a lost cause right there. So that's that was my ending of that. And that's seriously what you have to do. If someone doesn't know you and just judges you like that, they aren't worth caring for. They're they're not like worth the attention that they're trying to get from you, or that the attention they're trying to get for themselves. It's just not worth it if they can just judge you that quickly from something as silly and as small as that. And if it's a, if it's a different topic, why should you care about what these people think? Like, you enjoy your life and you live it the way you want to. And you just be yourself. And the people that are worth making friends with are the people that care about you and won't judge you in a few seconds just from a story they hear or things they heard about you. And that is my little base off that. So guys... <laughs> this is still gonna rock me. This is still gonna be a part of me of caring a lot and that's always who I will be. But just not care as much. And... These commentaries really do, like, are like a way for me to, to vent my feelings, to like vent. And like, even talking about this is like enforcing for me and it's, it's nice to do. And definitely topics that are like uh, true to me and this, this one definitely is a big part of my life. And I just wanted to get that out. So I know some of you have this problem and I know a lot are affected by this. And just, yeah, basically what I said before, they are not caring for if they can just judge you that quickly and you should work to care and work to care about the people that you want to care about you, that they are worth caring, that they are worth like doing stuff for and they are worth the attention, not people that can just judge you and matter of seconds and not people that are that judgmental and that quickly that's shallow and yeah so the cupcakes you wanted to know they were a pretty big hit and this clip is insane like where the fuck was that first guy but uh yeah the cupcakes were good everyone loved them and it all turned out better than expected so yeah guys here's Bamfita and me's clip Oh my god, I